Hello. Hi, everybody. Uh, this is a, a, work, uh, a working group, NASA, uh, from uh, International Astronomical Union. We are in this moment integrated in the key initiative in education, outreach, and development. It's a new working group of IAU. Then uh, I would like to introduce what is NASA. Uh, we uh, essentially work uh, training teachers, training teachers in astronomy education. Normally, the feeling of the teachers is that astronomy is uh, something very difficult. This is the first idea that the majority of them have. Then uh, we believe it is uh, the future of astronomy is the astronomers, the future astronomers in the school in this moment, that it is important to give uh, education and uh, activities and uh, knowledge to the uh, teachers. And what we do, we do with an innovative way, versus on hands-on activities with very simple and not expensive resources and tools. We promote observations in something, in some cases with amateurs if they don't have a telescope. And uh, we obtain uh, the certification of excellence in transmission of contents by the quality management system ISO. This was um, uh, a quality system that created engineers many years ago. And we are uh, accepted with this certificate in non-formal education. Well, uh, this is uh, the map of NASA. Uh, we have 900 volunteers in 70 countries because we organize many, many courses. And of course, it's not possible only with a very reduced number of people. Then uh, uh, how we uh, connected with teachers? Astronomy, fortunately, is an esteem subject. Esteem is fashion now in education. <laughs> then we have the opportunity to convince, to approach, to mathematics teachers, physics, chemistry, biology, and also uh, geography, social science, then it is important that we uh, offer to them uh, ideas in order to use the astronomy, because the astronomy is important for a student. The students love astronomy. The problem is that teachers know, but the students love. Then we try to fall in love of uh, teachers with astronomy. This is our main idea. Mm -hmm. How we do? We create local groups. In each one country, we have one or two. It depends on the big, small countries. And uh, in this moment, we have 75 NASA local groups. What they do? They teach the courses. The first course normally is a group of um, the organizers from NASA members that go to there or work online. And after they create the group, the local group, that they continue with this task, OK? Then uh, I would like to show you the map of courses. Uh, uh, we begin to work in the, the, the year of astronomy in 2009. And in this moment, we are organizing the course number 299, practically 300, OK? Then uh, also we organize, uh, in some cases, courses in cooperation with other institutions. Uh, and we are working in total in 70 countries. This is the concrete numbers. I only would like to mention that we uh, have in our website the list of 9,000 teachers that participate in our courses in this number of, um, of countries that I didn't mention before. Uh, what is special in NASA? Uh, we adapt our activities to the characteristics of each one country. Of course, we adapt latitude and longitude, this is clear, but also we teach in the language of the country. It is a stupid that we organize one course of astronomy in Peru or in Mongolia, teach in English, because nobody speaks English in Peru and Mongolia, OK? Then we have to teach 
in Spanish, in Peru, this is easy for us, but in Mongolian is not so easy, but we are doing, and we have uh, the, the first week of June, we have uh, one course there, okay? The, this is very, very important. If we want that the teachers use the materials, they have to receive the materials in their language, the PowerPoint in their language, they can use directly in the, in the courses, uh, also materials in their language, and uh, we prepare some videos and something like this that after I will explain to you. Uh, also, uh, for us, it is very important to connect astronomy with the culture. It is not good that they imagine that astronomy is something that two or three clever people from abroad go to there and they explain and try to convince that this is very important. No, no, they need to know that astronomy is part of their life. In their culture, they, their ancestors, they use astronomy because they need to eat. And astronomy was very important in the past in order that the people eat. No? Then uh, we are motivated to explain that the astronomy of uh, day by day, the astronomy in the city, the astronomy that we use in normal situation. For instance, I have here one picture in Mongolia that I visited uh, the first time, and they have uh, these small uh, small houses in the mid in the middle of the countryside, and then uh, have normally solar panels. And all the solar panels they are oriented one to there, the other to that, and it was absolutely disorganized. And uh, well, uh, one of the things that I explained in, in the course that how to do it in a good way, you know, <laughs> because this is part of their life. Uh, this is important for them. Okay. Also, uh, uh, I would like to to mention that uh, when uh, appeals COVID, uh, uh, well, at first we was absolutely a tonnage, uh, the same than the rest of the humanity. But after uh, really uh, COVID was an opportunity for us, a very important opportunity because we begin with courses online. Uh, courses online that never are recorded. It is a course that is integrated with the people. We are working with them. Uh, they have to connect with a camera that we can see what they are doing because we are practical, very practical, and they have to do activities with us. And normally we prepare these activities and they receive one list and they have to do with us and can, they can ask because it is a, a, a connection, an easy connection with chat, no problem, okay? Then uh, we believe that courses online for us have important advantages because for instance, uh, participants they were from the villages, not travel. This is important. In Africa, the people have to take a bus three hours, three hours when they are only, I don't know, 20 kilometers, I invented. But that this is a serious problem for them. Our participants, the majority of our participants are women. The women are in the house. In our online courses, they are with the children, if they have small children, and they can work with us, with the children, and the children also participate by doing the activities. Yes, then this is important. It is easy for women. Uh, also, we enter in the uh, home, uh, in the, maybe in some cases, we enter in the personal room of these people, and then our connection is a, a special connection. We have a special complicity with them. And then uh, at the beginning, no, but after uh, a couple of hours, uh, they feel that we are friends and they can ask to very simple things and without problems. And I think this is a very, very important in order that, uh, well, all of us, we are in the same boat, no? And all of us in the same interest and we can create and work together. Three minutes. minutes. Wow. Okay. Then uh, uh, there are some difficulties. What is the difficulties that we have? Outside. We cannot go outside. In our courses, we are doing activities and we go 
to, I don't know, to, to work with the shadow of the sun or something like this. Another problem, darkness. We never have darkness if we are using one computer with a wonderful screen, um, luminosity in all the places. Then in these cases, what do we do? Then uh, we prepare a special, uh, a special videos, very, very simple uh, videos of only one, two minutes, no more. More longer videos is not good for a classroom because they interrupt the structure. And these videos are mute, then uh, nobody speak, and the speaker of the session can use the video in order to, to comment what they believe. We have four kinds of uh, courses. Uh, we have the general course that include everything, and also we have concrete courses, one about astronomy, about the air, the sun, and the moon, the elemental, astrophysics, star evolution, and cosmology, also galaxies and Milky Way, of course, astronomy and culture that I mentioned before, and all these courses are independent, and the participants can uh, participate. Well, it doesn't matter, they, they no problem, because uh, uh, it, it, each one course is independent. Then what is our methodology? I think this is the crucial point of NASA. We promote that the students think using observation and some models that themselves construct. Them, not a black box. No, they construct the models in a very simple way. And they, uh, we use low tech. Then uh, they have to think in order to understand what they are doing. This is, I think, very, very important. Well, all our materials are in one book that we translated in this moment in 10 different languages, and we are working in 14 languages more. Uh, for us, this is important, all the language in the world. For instance, uh, Swahili, we are working in Swahili, we are working in Hindi, of course, official languages in the big countries. We have many, many women working in NASA. In some cases, NASA is a, a working group of women <laughs> in some case. Well, we work also for blind people. Uh, we have materials special for them. We use them, for instance, one photometer of cheek to cheek is a, a sand spot, uh, sorry, a pot photometer, but uh, using the cheek of the people and the results of the blind people was absolutely impressive. And every year we create one specific uh, project with UNESCO uh, that we involve many people from many countries. And uh, we believe that it is important. For instance, this year we determine the latitude repeating the process used by Magallanes, Elcano, or Columbus when they have in the equatorial area. This is the project that we have. And uh, well, you are invited to participate and we invite some participants in online event and in the Ciencia en Acción um, uh, edition, final edition. And I want to finish with this uh, sentence that my colleagues from China say to me that Confucius never said that, but it doesn't matter. From my point of view, it is not important who was the author of this sentence, but I think it is very, very important because I do and I understand. I think this is the most important from our point of view. They have to do astronomy, astrobiology, astrophysics, it doesn't matter. Do. Okay, then this is all. Thank Thanks for the work <laughs> of so many years all around the world. And if there are any questions, yeah, por favor, Victor. Well, we don't have money, and then we cannot promote the course. Then uh, we begin uh, mainly in South America, because I said that we teach in the language of the country. When we begin with our materials, was English and Spanish, okay? And then uh, we discover that if you organize a very good course 
very good level because the level is higher. It's not a stupid level. We don't teach. Uh, the materials are simple, but the concept, okay? Uh, with quality, the people talk with other people and say, oh, I was in a fantastic course. You have to organize in your country. And then we continue with this way, no? And uh, in this moment, we are in 70 countries. Uh, we are in all the countries that they are interested. For instance, in the General Assembly in, in, in Korea, we organize a course there, teach by Korean teachers, Korean instructors of NASA, to Korean uh, normal teachers, and in Korean language. Uh, this will be, uh, I don't remember the days, but at the beginning of August. But we are especially motivated for uh, countries in Africa, for instance, that they don't have anything. They don't have uh, a prisma, they don't have a thermometer, and, and we have to send to them materials in order that they can repeat the Herschel experiment, for instance. No? Then, uh, in any case, uh, uh, our success is because the people explain one to other one, because we cannot promote, we don't have money. I like Oh well, it is very difficult to find financial support. We try in many countries to work together with the Ministry of Education when it's possible, but this is difficult. For instance, in Bolivia, the Evo Morales uh, was uh, print our book and distribute one book to each one school in Bolivia, okay? But finish Evo Morales and now pwah, the, the new one, <laughs> government decided that we are stupid because we work with, but pff, I don't know. It is it is very difficult, but in any case, pff, we continue. Uh, I, I suggest to continue the discussion uh, okay. uh, later on. And uh, we thank uh, Maria again.